Hi, this is Danny Doyle, and we're here with some more big giant route map. Yep. Yep. Uh, we get a Brave Axe. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. And we have Fiona, um, replacing Tabarn, the super power level Fiona. Woo. Um... She's, she's, look at her, <laughs> look at her. Um, well, he certainly here is what I'm going to say about uh, her. We should probably give Sigrun, like, actual weapons. That might be a good idea. There. That, those count as actual weapons. She's, uh, certainly a unit that exists. Yeah, she is. Um... I guess we can do this. Oh, we should probably give our staffers staffs. Yeah, it might be a shout. And and Oliver also takes mend. And I guess Risk could get a weapon. He's not gonna do anything with it, but he can get one. Yeah, you can have one. Just just as a treat, right? Just as a little bit of a treat. Uh, I don't actually, like, think that low deploying would be the ideal strat here, just because, like, I don't think Fiona and Nephany are quite on the same level that Ike and Nyla are. Yeah, they're definitely not. Oh, I don't think we're deploying... I don't think we want Brolf, though. Um... I would like Shadow Boyd, actually. I think Shadow Boyd's probably... The go-to, and just risk so crashing the game. game but yeah. All right, time for Silent World. Let's go. Me when the world is silent, for real, for real. For real, for real. I mean, that's pretty good right there. Yeah. He uses hammer bow, the patented hammer bow, and then Titania. <laughs> Titania, why do you suck so bad? Jesus Christ. Yeah, that was that was that was sad. That was really sad. Hey look, she got a level up though. She did. Um Okay, well we fixed Har, so we can use I can fix you to just mm. Har smash. And have him go down here. I forgot just how much experience these units give, these enemies give. Mm. Uh, Fiona, how do you do here? N this is this is our fucking Tabarn replacement. Just mm. in case you forgot. Yeah, that's not, uh, she's that's Louise. Not, uh... I mean, I don't see any better use of the Brave Bow than this. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty sad. Um. I sucks. There we go. There we go. Uh, no. And then we can dance for you. I can dance if we want to. Oh, wait. Right, it's not the Leanne one. It's the Raisin one. I thought it was Leanne. So I thought I was going to get two dances out of it, but I did not. Uh -huh. Rip. Okay, Oscar sucks. Oscar sucks gaming. Okay. Okay. Um. And then we just... I think we just Green Lance these guys. Yeah, I think so. Oh, Impale! See, Nephany knows what's up. She knows we're not here to fuck around. She's a gamer. She is. She's she's gaming. Okay. Give you... Steel Lance. Equip. Killing Edge. Okay. 
you just, like, hang out over here. The obnoxious thing is... So the obnoxious thing about this map is, in addition to, like, Peleus showing up, uh, there's oh. some, like, random reinforcements that show up, like, all over the shop. And the top yeah. right corner is a big place for just, like, annoying random reinforcements to show up. I don't know why they decided that they're, like, such a huge fan of, like, the whole, um... I don't know why they decided that they were such a fan of, like, oh yeah, the enemy is just gonna appear from behind you. And, like, I think, I think the enemy appearing behind you can work. Um, mm. but the way that it works in these maps doesn't really... Because it's, like... Um... Rather than it being like, oh, super scary enemies are chasing you down mm, mm. in an objective that's not route, since this is a route map, it's either like, oh, I have to turn around and fight these people, or in the case of like the previous two maps, the map encourages you to do a defensive formation and then they're just like teleports behind you get fucked. Yeah. And I don't really care for that, actually. Yeah, it's pretty... not good. Okay, how does... how does Zhark do? I think he might actually be better than Peleus. <laughs> I think <laughs> Reverse Recruitment Zhark might just be an improvement on Peleus. But I am a big Zhark fan. Like, well known. I was just saying, I was like... I was like, you are a fan of Zhark, this is known. But, like, the reason I like him, I don't like him in part four. I like him specifically because uh, the Dawn Brigade needs those stats. They He's do like need those the stats. the only unit in the Dawn Brigade with actual functional stats for at least, like, some portion of the game. Uh, uh. And so, like, him replacing Peleus and... How close, actually, are these bases to his vanilla bases? Oh, I can check. Let me check. 21 strength feels higher, 29 speed feels higher, and 17 defense feels significantly higher. I mean, you'd expect, I'd expect them all to be higher, yeah. Because, like, he's above the level that you'd need to be able to turn him into a true blade with a seal. Right. Yeah, he's right now he's level twelve, and he in vanilla I think he starts at level three. Yeah, I thought. Yeah. Okay, let's check. Out. Yeah, he's not level sucks. three. So he'd have um seventeen strength, uh twenty three speed. 13 defense. So he's about plus 4 in all relevant stats. Yeah. Honestly, that's not even that different from what I would expect a vanilla Z-Hark to be like. Like, I think a vanilla Z-Hark I would probably have at a True Blade at this point. Uh -huh. Um, And I don't like True Blade vanilla Z-Hark in part 4. Maybe it's just because the rest of my army sucks so much ass. <laughs> then I'm just like, oh, a unit who can kill someone after they've been chipped down? You Amazing. must be, you must be a gift from God. <laughs> oh no, Har's gonna take effect to damage from that crossbow. Damn, Shadow Boy falling off. Oh right, it's a fucking Blizzard. That guy is <laughs> such an obnoxious placement, too, because he's just, like, yeah. annoying to get to. I mean, we can kill him with horror, but... He is just annoying. Yeah. Definitely. So, we've gotten Zhark replacing Peleus. Yep. And we also got, um, uh, did we get Seronio yet? No, we didn't. 
Teronia no, replaces Teronia Oliver. Replace Oliver. Um, so what I'm excited for is normally when you get stuff on, it's like, oh, well, I've got a true blade, but the map is like basically over at this point, so like it's not a huge oh, deal. Oh. Yeah. Fiona! Oh my lordy lordy lordy. Fiona, please. We're, we're begging you here, please! This is my Tabarn replacement, y'all. This is my Tabarn replacement. I feel the need to remind everyone. Yeah. Um, I'm thinking that it might be advantageous to rush the Stefan recruitment, because he's uh -huh. chill, and so that's another flyer in the desert. Yeah. I think that makes sense. I am excited to see what her stats look like. Auto leveled up to Stefan's level. Yeah, that should be interesting. It'll be like the payoff of hyper training and investing in Jill without having to actually hyper train and invest in Jill. Real. Which is nice. I mean, I like hyper training and investing in Jill, but like, it is undeniably a downside. Wow, you don't even kill with that. You suck. Yeah, that's pretty abysmal. Oh, hey, we got the coin. Okay, so I think what we do... Watch this. Watch these strats. Oh, yo, yo, strats. Shine barrier strats to keep Shadow Boyd safe. Let's go. Okay, so you... have the obnoxious blizzard range... Uh, we'll just, I guess, do this. And you can heal up. I think that this turn is when we get some, like, annoying people in the top right corner. Yeah, I think so. Ugh. This is, like, the least bad of the part four maps we've played, but it's still pretty bad. Yeah. Nice dodge, yeah. Fiona. Okay, Fiona can probably Brave Bow down the Blizzard Mage this turn. That'll be, like, a good use for her. Nice Impale. This map is also, like, it's definitely better in vanilla. Because in mm. vanilla, you, like, can have Tabarn fly over the trees and grass and stuff. But, like, yep. with Fiona as our Tabarn replacement, she's slowed down by the grass more than the infantry. So it's just, yeah. like, really annoying. Oh, God. I just realized, like, she's going to have to oh, deal no. with swamp maps. Oh, shit. Fiona is cursed to always have to That's deal so with cursed. swamp maps. That's so cursed. Uh, tell me those Armor Knights are stationary. Uh, hmm. Okay, I don't think they can reach. Yeah, it doesn't seem like they can reach. Remember how I said Fiona will brave bow down the blizzard guy? Yeah. I don't think she's going to do that, actually. I agree with that. It's a good thing, actually, that she dodged the blizzard guy. Because, yeah, uh... Sure. <laughs> She would be, like, Omega super dead. Yeah, absolutely. Um, okay. Kill the Wyvern. Uh, if we Brave Lance you... Okay, we can Brave Lance you and then Kanto over to get healed by Reese. Give her the Steel Lance. Mend her up. Uh, 
Uh... God damn, okay. Well... Oh, Adept! Look at him go! Oh. Kinda, kinda awesome gamer mode right there. What a gamer. And then... We can move you to not be in that range. So, Shadow Boy goes... Oh, I guess you go here. Shadow Boy goes up, gets healed. Thank you, Oliver. Very good. Move you over here. Move you up to here. Move you up to here. Move you over here. Just getting ready for the people showing up in the top top right corner. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And horror can just fight these guys down here. I think there's also some like random sword masters that show up in the bottom right corner, like down here. Mm -hmm. But I don't remember what turn. Okay, so Seahark might die. Nope. This Blizzard guy is just absolutely not a threat whatsoever. Yeah, he's really hopeless, huh? Because like if if Zark got hit by the Blizzard guy, then I think he would have a chance of dying to the other sword master. Yes, I believe so. But since he dodged both the Swordmaster that he attacked and the Blizzard guy. Or he didn't dodge the Swordmaster, he adapted. I don't think he has a chance of death, even against the General, I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh. Especially yeah, because... One, two, three, four, five... Yeah, the General wouldn't have even reached, I'm pretty sure. Alright, so now... There's you... So we'll do this, and now you're boxed in. And so we will heal you. Yeah, we'll just heal you. Uh, I will send Fiona over here. Do that. And then have her canto up. You can soldier this guy. And... And I think we just concoction up. And I guess, like, I'm not really sure what else. I guess Oliver can move up in order to, like, potentially heal people. I guess. I guess. Because, like, if he dies, he dies. Yeah, if he dies, he dies. whoop de doo Oh, uh, I like, hate that whatever. there's grass <laughs> on both of these paths. Like, I hate that there's grass on both of these paths. It just makes any Cavaliers just feel bad. Really terrible. <laughs> really terrible, yeah. And not only is it, like, just from the starting area, but then, like, down here where Har is, there's more grass. Like, oh, I finally mm -hmm. got out. The I can fix you broke. I finally got out of there's the grass, no and there's more the grass. grass. Really. Like, it's just... Yeah, it's bad. Yeah. Uh... Flyers continue to be winning. Oh, right. Physic. How could how could I assume that there would not be an obnoxious amount of physics spam on this map? Honestly, that's my problem. Yeah. Yeah. God, Nephany. Stab. Nope. Okay, Har, I believe in you. We believe. And my belief is rewarded. Uh, yo, let's go. 
Okay, so you... Do you die? You probably do. Fucking hell. Shadow Boyd, how do you do? Okay, he actually lives. So if we have Riss kill this guy, then you... Just, like, having the incredibly pathetic people box in enemy reinforcements... Mm. That's just... Just Radiant Dawn Part 4 things, I guess. It really is Radiant Dawn Part, part 4 things. Uh, you have an attack of 42, an attack of 45. Versus defense of 21. Yeah, she doesn't do great there. Okay, so what I can do is have her go here with the Brave Bow equipped. Nephany can soldier this person. Oh good, she crit. I was gonna have Zhark finish, but he doesn't have to. Um Let's go. So if you do this. Dodge. Nice. Crit. Nope, but double adept. Double adept is good. Actually, I think Not that good. means... Oh, right. This is a tree that looks like a bushes, but it's a tree. Oh, I hate that. That's like... Obnoxious. Yeah, that's so diabolical. That's so diabolical. That's like in Thracia, the thickets in Thracia. Yeah, I was just, I was just thinking about um. Yeah, I was literally just thinking about sixteen B. Good job, Oliver. That was, one evil, that was one of the evil ass map. That's the teleportation tiles map, right? Yes. It's, yeah. I think that. The teleportation tiles are the least bad part of that map. I think that um, the Sarah recruitment and the thickets are a lot more evil than the teleportation tiles. Oh, but Danny, you see, I was forced to use multi and like throughout my entire playthrough, and towards the very end, he stepped on a teleportation tile that brought him all the way back. <laughs> to the beginning of the map! Oh, I remember that tile. That's a funny tile. Uh, have you beaten Thracia yet, or are you still- yes, I have now beaten Thracia, so you can so copy everything. The, have you pla do you, did you fall for any of the teleportation tiles on the other teleportation map? Yes, someone told me that they fought, I, but that I fought by the end of the map, I stepped on every single one. That's amazing. So z might die here, and I won't reset for him. Um, That's so bad. But he's still done more than the average Peleus does on this map. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh, damn. Hard got crit for three damage. God. This map, uh... Certainly do be existing. Yeah, it's certainly... Here. Yeah. So, who is in range of Z-Hark? I mean, he's, he's like, in a thicket... Or, he's rather in a grass, and he's fast, so, like, dodge tanking could happen. Shadow Boyd. Yeah. Shadow Boyd. I don't think that Physic Priest has a real weapon. I think he's just there to make our day miserable by healing people. Yeah, I mean, that seems to be the MO, so I'm inclined <laughs> it to It really is, yeah. Ugh. And anyone else who can reach Z-Heart... Nope, okay. Just Cav reinforcements there, okay. So then I can have Fiona... Do you- are you also Siege Tomes over here? No, just Physic Dudes. And Flyer with the Silver Lance. Okay, so I can have Fiona gun down one of the Wyverns with a Brave Bow. God damn. What the hell? Oh, right, it's not effective. I got gotcha. I got gotcha. <laughs> I forgot it was not effective. Even though we were just talking about that. 
because yeah. it just <laughs> feels wrong. It does feel wrong. Okay, we'll do this. Nice dodge. Okay, so instead... I guess let's just have her go here with... That... Uh, Oliver can heal up Zheart. Who can... I don't think these generals move. I th yeah, I th they look like they're in positions where they're not going to. I think... Har heals, Zheart kills the Physic guy. Well, because this one didn't move, even though he could have reached Zheart. Mm. So, that tells me... You know, they're, they're setting the precedent for stationary generals. Yeah. Okay. Get a crit. There we go. Okay. Shadow Boy gets to live another day. Woo. Okay, I think that's that's all that they're doing. Yeah, it looks it like feels it, huh? so I understand that we're like we're not giving much commentary for this map, but it feels like yeah. so much of this map is just like Okay, I guess I'll move this person up a little bit through the bushes. Yeah, there's just really not that much to go. say. Oh. Like there's some like oh Zart got an adept there. Oh and then he missed. Okay. Well that's our that's your full of commentary. Yeah. And they're also, just, Fiona really, performing they're just, they're way worse than say. she should, like, it just makes me sad. It just makes yeah, me sad. Yeah, it is sad. I'm surprised that Light Ruin's still up. It feels like it's been yeah, so many turns. While, huh? There's the Sword Masters I was thinking of. Okay, so you do this. Oh, nice soul! I'll gain that two HP. That's Woo. uh, nice. Now that's that's value. Smile. We're in value town now, baby. Yeah, exactly. Okay, we'll heal up with Oliver. Um, I guess like how does Har do here? Probably pretty good. Doesn't totally. double, but, like, takes no damage from anyone ever. And also stun, so, you know, there's that. There is that. Um, so you, we have to surround you now. Oh, good job. Good job, buddy. Uh, okay, so we will go here, Vulneraria. Okay, and just trap you like that. Uh, you can... Romhack Soldier over here. Nice job, Nephany! What is Panakia again? Oh, uh, yeah, it's the consumable item that cures status. So it's basically just a cure for silence and poison? Yeah, I guess so. Uh, like, are we doing... I don't know. I don't know what we're doing. I don't know what we're doing. Sing for Nelucci. I just don't know. I just don't know. <laughs> That's so fair. 
Like, none of these scrubs matter. I don't have a training project here to focus on. I just... It doesn't matter. Oh. You have two range. Okay, I didn't realize you had two range. Damn. All that... All that damage. All that damage. From that crossbow. It's Ugh. a good thing that they have crossbows to counteract flyers. Otherwise, Har could trivialize this map. Yeah, imagine that. I did just get poisoned, so maybe I'll use that Panakia. Maybe, maybe. Otherwise, I'll die to the poison at my 21 HP. True. Nice! He got speed! Iron what a Axe broke, though. Sadly. Oh! Goodbye, Shadow oh, Void! Rip. Rip Shadow Void. He had a hammer on him, too. But I think we have one in the convoy, so it's fine. Hopefully, uh... I'll stagger my saves just in case. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, well, we might not need to. You know, I laughed about the poison, but Har could actually get knocked down to the point where he dies of poison. Like, it's it's semi-realistic that he takes five points of yeah, damage. Yeah, it's semi-realistic, yeah. Okay, the healers have started. Okay, never mind. Okay. Never mind, sorry, Shadow Boy, you stay dead. Okay, so yeah, we can have Har are... go over here. Grab the Panakia. Even when he's status, it just makes more sense to use the Vulnerary. Because the Panakia doesn't save him as much HP as a Vulnerary would. Yeah. Okay, so we can Brave Lance you. God, Fiona just makes me sad. Fiona just makes me sad. This was going to be this was going to be her moment. I mean the thing that's really sad about it, right? Is that like you literally like went and then trained up to Bond to the point where he literally killed Ike, and then this is the reward for that, right? Yeah, it's it's pretty bad. Yeah, it's pretty it's really abysmal. Well, shoot. Okay, Oscar sucks still works. God, Kieran just like performing better than the Super Omega buffed Fiona. What do their stats look like? 28 versus 26. He's just better than her in almost every way. She's faster and mm. bulkier. Okay, maybe it's just the strength stat, but still. Yeah. It's still pretty sad for her. Okay, I think I should, uh... Eh. There we go. go. There we go. There we go. And now she has soldier equipped to deal with that guy. Okay. So we're good. We're good. Well, I mean, this squad isn't very good. Um um how fucked are they? <laughs> pretty fucked. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> oh, this uh. is pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Okay. Um. Uh. Um. Well, I, yeah. Lamal. Uh. I mean, Riss wow. is super. Dead. Yeah, he's Riss so is super dead. He's so dead. Um. Like, how does he do against the Killing Edge guy? <laughs> <laughs> the question is, do we want to rescue him or just let him die? I would just let him die. Like, heck, I don't know what else you're going to do with him, honestly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
Cause like I could rescue him. I could rescue him. And they'll go for Ranolf probably. <laughs> <That's>... Yeah. <laughs> I just sort of Oh this is this is it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> fine. Totally fine. <laughs> Goodbye, Renolf, though. <laughs> Thank you, Renolf, for your sacrifice. The fact that you switched over to be an incredibly shitty unit means that we get Super Nephany. Which is worth. It is worth. She's been such a gamer. <laughs> Goodbye, Renolf! <laughs> he gets doubled! He has, do he has one rounded. That's fucking sad. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty funny. That was pretty funny. <sighs> yeah, this is the other thing that they like doing. It's just like scattering units all about to make the route take even longer and be even more obnoxious. And I just, I just, I just hate it. Yeah. Yeah. Is that, is that anyone who likes Radiant Dawn Part 4? Uh, well, so someone in my Discord server is currently doing a thing where she's asking for, like, different opinions about every game in this franchise. Oh, um, oh. and she's gonna make, like, a spreadsheet where people will agree or disagree with all the opinions. And, yeah. um, some of the opinions, one of the opinions that stuck out to me was, like, Radiant Dawn Pot 4 is actually good. People exaggerate how bad the maps are, um... And then they were like, the only actually bad map is the desert because it's a desert map. And all of the other ones are fine. Um, and I would say like, I think that the issues that they have with the desert, like that that person has with the desert map are just not the same issues that I have. Cause I like some desert maps. I think that it just being an incredibly long route map that's obnoxious to move through and has a bunch of siege tomes that'll double you is like the issue more so than it being I don't think that that map not having sand would it obviously would make it it wouldn't make it worse but I don't think it would make it better like I would have the same issues with it yeah I agree but to each their own I guess the point that I that I have with that is that like there are people who like Fire Emblem 7. Um, so, like, to each their own. There's all sorts of opinions out there. Oh, for sure, for sure. That's interesting, though. I think also, these maps appeal to the sort of person who routes every map anyway. Because, mm -hmm. like, my big issue with a lot of these maps is, like, they shouldn't be route maps. Yeah, you should just, like, kill Baltome, call it a day, or something. Like, 4 Prologue feels like a defense map. Um, if 4 Prologue was a defense map that, like, lasted until, um... Until, like, one turn after... Or two turn... Yeah, one turn after those purge reinforcements, right? Yeah. I would like it a lot better. Defense is, like, my least favorite objective. Well, actually... You know, defense is my least favorite objective, because I think you can fix route easier than you can fix defense. But I still think that that map would work better as a defense map than a route map, because there's no reason to have to go around and clean up all of those calves that are, like, scattered throughout. Same with the fog map. Like, if that was just, mm -hmm. like, a survive for 15 turns thing, um, then it would potentially be interesting to, like, full deploy and just assume a defensive position. But since... Yes. Since it's- and you could go aggressive as well, because defend maps oftentimes going aggressive can reward you as well. Um, yes. but since it is just a fog of war map with a bunch of like, you have to push forward and kill people, but then they're getting physicked from in the fog and- I mean, we spent, what, like 10 turns looking for the last guy, and I feel like that's a not Something uncommon like that, yeah. experience. And then this one, again, like you said, it should just be kill boss. Like, just kill Valtome. Um, I think Oliver's mansion should have been a seize map. Like, Oliver is literally on a throne. And yet, it's not a seize map. 
Yeah. So. Yeah, so we have another hammer on Kieran, so it's fine for Shadow Boy okay, to stay dead. Rip Bozo. Rip Bozo. Shadow Boy and Ranulf can uh, reunite in the Shadow Realm. True! Shadow Boy's natural habitat. <laughs> yeah. He gets uh, Eid's biorhythm bonuses because his affinity matches with the maps. Oh my god, there's more of them! No, why are there more? I thought we were almost done. Are you the bolting guy? No, you're Arc Thunder. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry so much. And again, like, if this weren't route, those guys w showing up behind you would be like, hey, they're threatening. Chase you down. Like, you gotta kill the boss. It's time. Like, you gotta kill him. Mm-mm. Okay, I think we do want to heal you. Turn Resolve off, unfortunately. Pew! 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 But yeah, the, um... The, like, single cav reinforcements that show... Single cav, single warrior reinforcements that show up in random corners. Yeah. Uh, the other thing about them is they don't feel like they're scary reinforcements in any way, shape, or form. Um, yeah, I agree with that. Why was Ranolf there? He's dead. I think the game is glitching. Yeah, I think the game is, like, <laughs> freaking out. I mean, understandable, like, this Nephany, like, okay, I was about to say she destroys everything, but clearly not. Well, she was just showing mercy. True! Oh, speaking of... No, huh. she doesn't get Mercy. No. Okay. Okay, so... Conclusion. Mercy went to the Void? <laughs> Mercy's in the Shadow Realm with Shadow Void? Yeah, I guess so. Ah. Uh... Okay. Dance for you. Wait. Okay, did we run- we had this issue before, right? Where I thought there was weapon triangle, but we did the math and there isn't, it just displays for some reason? Yeah, it just displays for some reason. Oh my god, Sigrun! Please, Sigrun, please. But yeah, like, this single cav down here... Clearly doesn't exist to be threatening. He kind of just feels like he exists to be a chore for you to clean up. Yeah. Like, hey, we're just gonna give you, like, a single cav or a single warrior. And, like, I know it's that's a little bit Kieran. rich from me, considering I lost two units to that fucking general. Yeah, that was pretty funny. <laughs> um, but, like, that's because those units were super underleveled and untrained and, like, disposable. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking of underleveled, untrained, and disposable units, like look at Zark dealing fourteen damage. Woo. Okay. Okay. Strength and skill. I'll take it. Has he capped speed? I don't think so. Sigrun, thank you for finally hitting. 3,000 years. It's been 7 million hours. No! No! Physic! Oh no! Oh Stop my god! Stop it! Stop it! Game, no! Why? Stop it! <laughs> Sorry to disappoint you, but there's no Zelgius here. Only Fiona! <laughs> a 
Micaiah's gonna love that when we recruit her. Yeah. So much. Be so useful. Alright, so... Let's just... Kill the Physic guys. Oh boy. Um... Yeah, we'll just have the two of you team up to kill this guy. This is... this is... this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. I'm not at a breaking point at all whatsoever. This is fine. There we go. Gaming. Uh, so Har, kill the Arc Thunder guy, so you don't have to deal with him, right? Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, well... It's okay. Because we'll do this. Well, Kanto... Oh. Hmm. I thought I could Kanto and get danced. Uh, well, what we'll do instead... this. You just sort of, like, <laughs> be there. The sacrifice. Well, uh, not necessarily. She might not die. Is she allowed to die? Uh, she is a Lincia, so no. So no, she's not allowed to die. So hopefully she doesn't die. Yeah, hopefully she doesn't die. That's I guess what I'm saying. Yeah. Hopefully Shadow Boy doesn't get his revenge by killing off Alencia. Yeah, okay, she's fine. Nine okay. damage, she's fine. Even if she got crit, she wouldn't have died there. Oh. Okay. And now, I believe this is the last group of, of obnoxious reinforcements we have to deal with. Thank god, it's nearly over. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh... Okay. Steel Lance broke and so did my resolve. Okay, and then you just head down this way. Go over here. Dance. Very good, very good. You go here, kill. Or rather, don't kill, but don't die yep. either. Or die. I mean, you know, it's a thing. The same thing, basically, right? God, you suck so bad, Fiona! Okay, that so bad. Ah. Uh... Okay. You, I guess, both go down here. The bishop bros. Okay. Uh. Nope. Nope. Okay. Oh, dang. Well, okay. Okay, Z-Hawk. I see how it is. He he was just getting a little too full of himself because I complimented him like once.
God, those stationary generals, the fact you have to kill them too. Again, just because this is a route map for... Some reason. Some reason. We just really desperately need all of these units dead. I don't I don't think we'll I don't think the uh the march to the tower will be able to survive if any of those unarmed bishops are alive. Real Real gaming hours. Good job, Oliver. Okay, and then you Heal up. There. You go here. What time, does, what time does that mage have? Uh, I checked. It's not electric. Okay, okay. He only deals 19 damage. Yeah, that's definitely not it's fun to turn fire. So. It's all Gucci. It's all Hooray. Gucci. Excuse my lack of enthusiasm. Part 4 <laughs> has has that effect on me. It has that effect on everyone? Well, okay, maybe not actually everyone. It's having that effect on both of us. Oh, there we go. Okay. He's making up for the two hits that he missed last time. Yeah. I love that the mage attacks at one range. I know that it's because I have a 1-2 range, the copium equipped. Yeah. But still... It's just always funny to me when they do that. It is pretty funny. Dodge and kill! Okay, okay, okay. And he got speed again! Woo! Okay. <laughs> okay. Jesus Christ. Amazing. Here we go. Strength Oliver. Strength level. You said Riss wasn't going to do anything useful for us? You said... Riss wasn't going to do anything useful for us. I did say us. that. I did say that. And yet, how foolish yet. you must feel now that I he's know, killing the so last foolish. enemy sure left on the map. Me. You sure shown me. Hey, this you know is I why you should this? always reset for Riss if he dies. Otherwise, you'll get soft locked against this generic soldier. Oh my god! Why is it? Why are all the strange bishop? <laughs> Yeah, Lord, why? <laughs> it's so that when they overclass into Baron, they can use physical weapons better. Mm, yeah, so many physical weapons. Subscribe for physical weapons. Bye. Bye.